Hello everyone, Master Zach here. Today, I'm going to be watching the Game Awards 2023 uh, nomination announcement. Uh, so yeah, uh, as always, uh, Game of the Year Awards is a very, very fun experience. I am still not over the fact that they snubbed Amori from uh, the indie, uh, best indie game, I think it was last year or the year before, I can't even remember. Uh, but yeah, this should be a lot of fun, especially since I'm hopefully going to be able to watch the Game Awards live. Uh, and yeah, you know, Game Awards, always great. Uh, so yeah, there are a lot of things. I'm hoping to see, uh, I think there's a best movie category. I'm hoping there's uh, Five Nights at Freddy's and uh, Mario there. Other there than have that, been so many great games oh, also I hope that uh, Breath of the Wild is, or er, uh, Tears of the Kingdom. Celebrate the best of the best Hold up, it's a little quiet. Awards, streaming live everywhere from right here at the Peacock Theater in Los Angeles. I'm Jeff Keighley, and it Jeff is Keighley. finally time Jeff Keighley, they still stole my Jeff Keighley mask. More than 30 I want my Jeff mask back among us. The winners, you can vote in all categories. Start I, we will be voting, chat, and I will be influencing you as an individual. A TGA. I will be Filled forcing you to vote. Now, game announcements from teams around the world, and in the coming weeks, we will have much more to share. But now, I am honored to get to the task at hand. All right. Here are the nominees as selected by our voting jury for the Game Awards 2023? Okay, let's see. Best, best performance. The nominees are N Star as Clyde. Don't know who this is. I'm gonna turn Cameron down a little. Cameron Monaghan as Cal Kestis, Star Wars Jedi. Don't Survivor. know this. Idris Elba as Solomon Reed. Know this from ads. 77 Phantom Liberty. Melanie Liebert as Saga Anderson. Don't know this. Wake two. Neil Newbon as a Star Wars. Don't know this. Baldur's Gate three. And Yuri Lowenthal don't know this. Partner. Okay, so we, we just two. don't need to vote on that. Game, Got it. I'll just listen to Apex everyone else. Legends. No. Cyberpunk Come on, Fortnite. Fortnite, Final baby. Come on. Fortnite. It's Fortnite. Genshin We're voting that. Impact. No. In the oh, no. Genshin Impact's there. Shoot. Discord. Baldur's Gate 3. Nah. Diablo 4. Nah. Party Animal. Nah. Street Fighter 6. Nah. Super Mario Brothers Wonder. I don't think Not Wonder fits for that category, Mario. but I'll probably vote for it. Alan Wake Two. Because I like Mario. Hi Fi Rush. Hi Fi Rush. Okay. Of P. Super P. Mario Brothers. Super. Mar Mario. Okay. Okay. All right. The Legend of Zelda. Ooh, that's actually that's actually. I would say for art direction, Mario music. Wonder. Nominees Not. The, even Alan though it is. Composer uh, Alonka, Yeah. Okay. Baldur's Gate Three. Composer Boris Lovsky. For every Baldur's Gate's gonna win every category. I'm just gonna say that. Composer. It's going to be like a God of War situation again. Hi-Fi Rush, audio director Shuichi Kabori, and The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. I don't know, I'll have to listen to their soundtracks. The best audio design I'm not a mood I'm not, I'm not a mood to propaganda though, so I don't know. I had not I forgot the Dead Space released this year. Uh, I'd probably go Resident Evil 4 there, I'm going to be honest. Authentically creating shows, movies, and other creative movies? Based on video game world movies, characters. chat? Five Nights at Freddy's? Five Nights at Freddy's? Come on. Castlevania Nocturne. Don't know that. Gran Turismo. <laughs> Gran Tur you didn't read the full title. Super Gran Turismo Mario based on a true story. Movie. Super Mario movie, and nice. Twisted metal. No are. We were robbed, chat. Baldur's Gate we were robbed. Cyberpunk actually robbed. I guess I'll vote Mario then, but Final like Fantasy actual 16. actual theft. And Marvel's theft at the red carpet, chat. Games for Impact celebrates thought-provoking games with profound pro-social. Dude, Baller Gates Three is for this everything, dude. It's gonna win. Genshin Impact. Space for the Unbound. <laughs> Chance of Sonar. Goodbye, Volcano High. Chia. I've only heard Terra of that Hill. one. And Benba. For best I, I don't know any of those. Are best indie game. Cocoon. Come on. Dave the Diver. No, it's not an indie Dredge. game. Sea of Stars. And Viewfinder. Best oh, player. that's the ah, are shoot. Final that's I, I I'll have to go dredge on that. I'm gonna think. Star Rail. Hello Kitty Island Adventure. I, I gotta go Hello Kitty. I I gotta I gotta rep Hello Kitty Island Adventure. That's what we're doing, chat. We're voting that. Exceptional support, transparency, and responsiveness to players. The nominees are best community support. Okay, Baldur's Gate Three. It's gonna win everything. Cyberpunk 2077. Destiny Ooh, 2. this is gonna be Final tricky. I think, 14. honestly, Cyberpunk just because they've no changed. Man's no, it's No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky. Okay, Vote in No Man's Sky. Mm -mm. Debut no. Indie game, which a debut indie game that hasn't been on the TGA stage before. 
In fact, Amori. Amori. published their first game in 2023. The you snubbed Amori. Cocoon. Cocoon. Dredge. It's Dredge. Pizza Tower. Oh! That released this year! Oh my gosh. No, it's gotta be Pizza Tower. It's gotta be Pizza Tower. It's gotta be Pizza Tower. It's gotta be Pizza Tower, Pizza Tower. Pizza Tower chat. I forgot that released this year. Nah. Gotta be Pizza Tower. Why wasn't it in the just normal best indie game category? Why was Dave the Diver there? They're not an indie dev. They're actually not an indie game. Iron Mouse? Me? Am I here? And Cypher PK. No, and me, Master Zack. Anticipated upcoming game. Remember, this has to be a game that's officially announced. The nominees are most anticipated Final game. Fantasy VII Rebirth. Hades two. Hades two. Actually, Hades two. Like a dragon, yeah. Infinite wealth. Star Wars Outlaws. And Tekken eight. Uh, yeah, I'd say I'd say Hades two. Adventure game are Alan Wake two. Dude, come on. Marvel it's gonna- oh my gosh, they're gonna have- They're gonna have Baldur's Gate for everything. Come on. No, oh, okay, not- not this. The one time it's not, okay. Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3. That's so crazy. This should win this, though, I think. Yeah, no, Baldur's Gate 3 winning best RPG would, would fit. God of Rock. God of Rock? Mortal Kombat 1. Huh? Nickelodeon's All Star Brawl 2. Why is the PNG cutout so poorly? Why was the PNG cutout so poorly on that? The nominees for best Bro, you're not doing yourself any favor. They did not send them the PNG. They did not send them the PNG. Ghost Runner 2. Hi Fi Rush. And Remnant 2. So many twos here. Jeez. Accessibility celebrates games that are making our industry available and enjoyable to more. Okay. Selected by a special committee of accessibility experts, this year's nominees for innovation. All right, what's gonna be here? Diablo Four. Diablo Four. Forza Motorsport. Forza. Hi-Fi Hi Rush. Rush. Marvel. Spider-Man Spider Two. Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat One. One. And, and Street Fighter Six. Six. Okay. Next up, best family, best family game. Mario. Are Mario. Disney Illusion Island. Mario. Party Animals. Mario. Pikmin Four. Pikmin. Ooh. Pick ooh. Ooh, Pikmin 4, though. Ooh, Pikmin 4, though, chat. That released? I thought that was, like, delayed forever. I thought they killed it. Ooh. Oh, pick okay, Pikmin 4. Pikmin 4. Pikmin 4. Pikmin 4 gotta win. They gotta bring the Pikmins on stage and they go... Hot Motorsport. Hot Wheels Unleashed 2 Hot Turbo Wheels Unleashed 2 Turbo Charge. That's a title. Now a look at our esports category. Esports? Me. I'm best the best esports e gamer. The nominees are Counter-Strike 2. CS2, no. League of Legends. League of Legends. PUBG Mobile. Fortnite. No, okay. Valorant. E athlete Me, I'm the best esport athlete. Demon 1. Faker. Hydra. Imperial Howl. Ruler, I'm gonna be honest, Zyla. the only one of these people that I, like, have heard the name of is Faker, so, like, I guess we're voting him. Evil Geniuses, Valorant. Fanatic, Valorant. Game and Gladiators, Dota 2. JD Gaming, League of Legends. What's the one Faker's on? Because he's the Vitality, only one I know. The best esports coach nominees are... Potter. Homie. Homie. Gumba. Ecstasy. And Zonic. And finally, the okay. For best e event this is the category I know nothing about. League of Legends World Championship. Last TV Paris Major 2023. Evo 2023. The International Dota 2 Champions. I might just vote Evo because that's the one I know. And Valorant Champions 20. Yeah, no, Evo might be. All right, you ready? It's time for our final. Okay, game of the year. Category. Best game direction, which recognizes Best game direction. extraordinary creative vision and innovation in Pizza Tower. Pizza design. Tower. Pizza Tower. This year's nominees. It's just going to be all the famous ones Alan ever. Wake yeah, it's Alan Wake 2, Baldur's Wake Gate 3, uh, Spider-Man Spider 2. 2, yeah. Super Mario, Mario Bros. Bros. A Wonder. Yeah, it's like and Legend, Legend of Zelda, Zelda Tears, Tears of the, the Kingdom. Kingdom. There was literally a category just okay, like this before. Finally, like, what are you talking about? Jury, I am proud to and, alright, Game of the Year is going to be the exact game same game thing as the previous games. category. Watch, it's going to be the Baldur's Gate 3, Alan Wake 2, Spider-Man 2, uh, 
Yeah, Alan Wake 2, yep. Yeah. Baldur's, 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 Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3. Spider-Man 2, yep. Yeah. Mario Wonder, Mario Wonder, and then uh, Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, Resident Evil 4. Because uh, it's 6, yeah. Super Mario Wonder, and then it's going to be Tears of the Kingdom. I called it. That's crazy. I mean, like... We just got the same things over and over and over. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna I'm gonna have to go debate this with myself, see which things I'm voting for, and see which things I'm gonna convince you guys to vote for. Uh and yeah. Ooh, yeah, the TGA orchestra, that's always fun. Oh, Super Mario Wonders, the orchestra is gonna Alright, I gotta think about this a lot, chat. But yeah, this should be great. Game of the year. Okay, there's some definitely good categories. Some categories I uh, I, I like. Some categories I'm kind of meh, meh, meh about. I think uh, Pizza Tower being in one of the indie categories, but not the other one, was kind of weird. Uh, and also Dave the Diver being there was weird, because it's by definition not an indie game. Like, it's it's made by a borderline AAA company, so whatever. But, uh, I don't know. It's gonna be fun. I also think it's so funny that they did not cut out their PNG. Like, this PNG... This was not given to them as a PNG, this was given to them as a JPEG image, and they had to control select the, the white layer, and whoever, whatever intern was uh, designed to... whoever in, Whatever intern was tasked with, like, making all these things was just like, I'm, I don't care. I don't care. Look at like the quality between like uh, some of these titles and some of the some of these. Of look, look at this title. Look at this title. Look at this. And like, look, like it's it's it is a clear, clear. They did not send the right files. They did not send the media pack. Anyways, uh, that was pretty cool. Uh, good to see. Good to see. Uh, some of the things. I don't know. Uh, I felt like I played a lot of older games this year, so I don't really care as much for some of the newer ones. But, uh, yeah, this should be good. Uh, this should be a fun game of the year. Uh, I wonder... Man, I wonder what shenanigans are gonna... I really I really think they should actually bring the, the Bill Clinton kid, like, on stage as, like, a, a an actual thing. Because if not, if they don't break the curse, if they don't st stop the cycle, it's gonna keep happening. Because remember, like, last time someone ran on stage... It was not as funny because they were a grown adult, but uh, yeah. Anyways, this uh, game awards, game awards, it's game awards season now, chat. That's great. Anyways, with that out of the way, thank you all for watching. Hope you all have a great rest of your day. Make sure you all stay safe out there, and I'll hopefully see you all later. Mm, bye.